what's up everybody welcome back to the crystal palace today we are in charleston south carolina we have one day here let's go make the most of it we're starting off at cypress garden here is a map of the gardens here we're gonna start off doing the self-guided boat tour here at cypress gardens movies such as the notebook and the patriot were filmed here so i'm really excited i want to do this boat tour and let's have a great day. Come join us. All right, so typically the way we do it is... Okay, how cool is this? Oh my God, here's our little rowboat, my paddle. Awesome, here we go. The guy said that there's over 200 gators in here. So far we saw two, two little babies. So let's see how many we could see. This is so peaceful. It's so fun getting to like row your own boat. All right, we're coming up to Duck Bridge. You have to duck. It's recommended to duck forward. Duck. Wait, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, we're ducking. No way. It's like not real. <laughs> Are you doing right? Okay, I'm through. I'm not. That was fun. We're going under the next bridge. Show you. Actually, you might have to duck a little bit. Yeah, I got it. Cool. They have even bigger boats. I think this is for the guided tours, but that was so much fun. That self-guided boat ride was so much fun. It was nice and relaxing and the views were amazing. So now we're gonna carry on and see what else is here. So after the boat ride, we made a right and now we're gonna make our way around the property. We ran into the memory garden gazebos. So let's check it out. Look, look at the lizard. <laughs> Oh my god, that's real? I thought oh it was my funny. God. <laughs> is it real? Yeah, it is. It just moved. Oh my god, hello. Oh my god, you see that? Yeah. You thought it was on you? Yeah. It no, looks... no. I had something on me, and then I looked over there, and I thought it was a fake toy. Look at them. Hi, buddy. You guys know in the parent trap when Lindsay Lohan puts the lizard on Meredith's head? <laughs> Well, anywho, our lizard friend was greeting us into the gazebo. It's just empty. There's two right next to each other. Such a pretty swing. So as we're on this beautiful nature walk, I'll tell you guys a little bit about Charleston. We actually took a trip here about two years ago. We went just to Charleston and Folly Beach. We stayed on Folly Beach. I highly recommend if you want to stay in the Charleston area, Folly Beach. It was so nice. They had a lot of great restaurants, great beach access. Staying there was a lot of fun. If you don't want to stay in the city and want more of a beach type of vacation. That being said, it was only a 20 minute drive. We Ubered because we flew that time into downtown Charleston. I love the city of Charleston so much. In Charleston, we got to go to the Citadel, which I highly recommend. We also went to Rainbow Row in Charleston, and they have really colorful houses. So we're going to try to do things a little different this time around on this Charleston trip. We're only here for a day. Just figured we'd stop through because we really love it here so much. This is the wedding gazebo right here. Probably put the chairs in this area. And that's where you can get married. This is a really cute spot. Pretty. These are very pretty wedding pictures. Oh, we have a little heart here. So cute. Here's another lizard. Hello. Can you jump on Joey, please? No. Aww. <laughs> so I really wanted to come here to do that boat ride because I love the notebook. And it's such a pretty scene in the movie. Not only the boat ride, but just everything about this place is really beautiful. And I'm so glad that we got to come. Here are some of the things that you may see on your journey. Woodpeckers, turkey vulture, ew, river otter. I wish I saw one of those. A rat snake, nope, nope. Not today, Satan, not today. I don't really know what a green rat snake is, but I know that I never want to see one in my life. A baby gator! Hi! We're headed into the gift shop so we can get a drink of water. Yeah, they have. Ooh, those are so cute. So the lady in the shop told us a lot of great info about alligators. They have two in captivity right now, Boss and Allie. 
boss is 60 to 80 years old. He came up here in the 80s and he's fully blind in his right eye. So that's why he's in captivity. Allie lost about a foot of her tail. So that's why she's in captivity. Also something interesting that I didn't know is that the gators eat once a week. They're not big eaters and they're pretty lazy. Crocodiles are the ones that are more like vicious and will attack you. But alligators, she said they just like to be left alone to sunbathe. They don't allow dogs in the park because you know, if they do get hungry, that's when they will attack. And now we're going to go into the swamp arium. No, 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 no. <laughs> he wants to get out, I think. It seems like some people bring their own lunch here. Um, that's something that's really fun to do if you want to do a little picnic. Here we are at the... Charlestown Landing. Charlestown Landing. This is a historic site. So we're now we're just hitting all the historic sites today. It's so interesting. This is the first permanent English settlement in what is now South Carolina. It was established in 1670. So we're going into the visitor center to purchase our park tickets. Adult is $12, the op hours of operation, 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. So right in the visitor center, they have this exhibit here, and it's all about the founding of Charleston in the early days. If you were leaving your home for an entirely new world, what would you take? That is a very loaded question. Let me know in the comments what you guys would take. We are headed in the animal forest. For $12 for adults and even f cheaper for kids, this is a really great deal. And not only do you get the zoo, but you get everything else here at the site as well. Wait, I love you. Bears are my favorite animals. He was so cute. I felt so bad for him. He was so lonely by himself. It's literally 4.30 p.m. <laughs> and Joey just walked by someone and goes, good morning. <laughs> Are you okay? Like, is all this traveling getting to you? It is. I, I don't know. I feel like we have so much left to do today that I'm still in the morning mood. If you're enjoying this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button down below. All right, that was a really great place to visit. We met a nice worker, took us around on the golf cart, down to the boat area, the water area where you could see downtown Charleston. So it was something that was really fun. You guys walk around, see some nature. It was a good experience. All right, tonight we are going to eat and have some drinks at Holy City Brewing. We decided to just sit at the bar because otherwise it was about a 30 minute wait and we want to really get into downtown Charleston. So here we are. We got an order of pretzels. They look so good. So here's the beers and IPA ciders that they make on this menu here. Joey got the, what's it called? Old Factory Hughes. Old Factory Hughes. And he really likes it. I also really like the pretzels. It has such a different taste. It has like brown sugar on it. But it's really good. And this is beer cheese, which is pretty cool. I got the Holy City salad with chicken. And Joey got what kind of burger? I got the Holy City burger. Bacon. Holy City lettuce, burger. Lettuce. Cheese. Pimento cheese. Fried green tomatoes. Cool. They have some live music. Outside. All right, this place is actually huge. We didn't know that it was this big. I mean, it's good to know that they do have this huge outside here with live music playing. Oh my god, it's like banjo. Yeah. It's so fun. This is so much fun out here. Oh my gosh. You could just come, just drinking beers hang out. You could order beer right up there. Come hang out. I want to just grab a beer and walk around this for us. It's so cool. So in the gift shop, look at these candles. It's so cool. They have really great merch here. It's nice. That's a nice hat. It is, right? It's a really nice hat. Joey made his own six pack and all of these cans are brewed here, which is so cool. They have really awesome ones. I love the- Oh, I'm glad you got the puff mutter because you <laughs> got that shirt. Yeah. I like sparkly princess. I want that. This is my favorite one I tried. If I was a local, I would come here very often. They have so many great events. They have burpees and brews. I forgot to tell you about that one. Burpees? Burpees and brews, Sundays at 10 a.m. They also have yoga and brews. If you're in North Charleston and you're into breweries, you're into beer, 
definitely come here. I mean, I'm not, like, I'm not a beer drinker, but I still had fun. It was really enjoyable. I liked the atmosphere. Now it's time to head into downtown Charleston. We just ran into Justine's kitchen. We just drove up into it. The sign is still up. I'm so sad. We're so sad. We honestly wanted to come to Charleston just to go to Justine's kitchen because it was so good. And unfortunately, it closed due to the pandemic. Okay, so they have a day and a night market. The day market opens at 9.30 and the night market is open Fridays and Saturdays. So we got lucky that this part was open and today is Saturday. So let's check it out. When we went, we went to the day market. So I wonder if it's gonna be any different. They have really cool stuff like these note cards. That is so cool. We have live music. <laughs> Oh my god, we just got our first caricature. That is so cute. Here is the famous pineapple fountain right here at the waterfront. It's really pretty at night. Wow. Look at this. I love it. Charleston has done it again. What a great day. What a great night in the city. I really love it here. This, I don't know, this still might be my favorite. It's great. I highly recommend if you're in South Carolina or you're looking to plan a trip down here, stop in Charleston. You will not regret it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to stay tuned for more fun here on the Crystal Palace. Be sure to like, subscribe, share, ring that bell to get notified every time I post a new video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.